Hi, how are you? It's Anne. What do you think of the frankincense, gold, and myrrh? Yes, whenever I'm talking, there's going to likely be something that will annoy somebody. Too bad. This time, I'm going to tell you that Muslim lives matter. The Muslim faith is not our enemy. Some people who have twisted the Muslim faith have decided it's time to come and fight with us. The problem is, we've also got people in the evangelical Christians who have gotten just as twisted and are shooting people because they're a different faith. This is not how we're supposed to be. This is not how our world is supposed to be. If you see someone who is a Muslim and you don't care to talk to them, fine. But if you're not going to say something nice, don't get in their face either. They haven't done a thing to you. We recently had in Texas a friend of mine who ended up throwing, taking her sweater off and throwing it over a 13-year-old girl because a bunch of nuthead, knothead jocks decided to rip off her hijab. My friend covered her with, the, with her sweater, took care of her, until her father could come to collect her. This is ridiculous. There was a gang of boys who attacked a single child because she was wearing a headscarf. There are mosques, sacred places that have been burned. People have been shot. It's not okay. It's not how we're supposed to be. If you've got nothing nice to say, walk on. Nobody says you have to stop. Nobody says you have to make a point of saying something nice. If you've got nothing nice to say, move on. Let them be because let me explain something to you if i'm somewhere near somebody who's doing something that foolish i will intercede one way or another they are just a different faith and their faith the basic tenets of their faith Start off with a prayer in the mornings that they do no harm. One of my niece's doctors explained that. We heard him praying, and she was the first patient of the day. We heard him praying in his office. And my sister, being who she was, and is, has a curiosity bump six miles wide. <clears throat> and she asked him what the words meant. And he said that it's a prayer that he says before he sees patients, asking that he do no harm. Don't turn around and look and go, 
oh, they're terrorists. Oh, they're fighting us. And guys, we're fighting ourselves. Really, we're fighting ourselves. There is more joy in giving and being accepting of each other than there is in this constant battle. Somebody of another faith is not necessarily, absolutely your enemy. A Muslim man or woman walking down the street is not necessarily just going to turn around and start shooting the place up. I'd be more worried about the guys with their open carry guns going to the 7-Eleven. It's like you can't go get a soda and a hot dog at the 7-Eleven without a gun. Come on now, especially something that's an assault rifle. Muslim lives matter. And I will continue to state that other lives matter. Peace be upon you.